Many Dancing with the Stars fans were absolutely enraged at the elimination results last night. Some even went so far as to take out their anger on two contestants, Bobby Bones and Joe Mobble. Advertisement, continue reading below at the end of an explosive night of dancing trios, host Tom Bergeron revealed the results from last Monday's most memorable years. Theme, gasps, boos, and yelling could be heard in the studio audience when he announced that the couples in jeopardy were Ivana Lynch and Kao Matsup and Tina Shea and Brandon Armstrong. Based on last week's scores and audience voting, Tina Shea and Brandon were eliminated. The results were very surprising, given that the couple sent home earned an impressive 27 out of 30 nowhere near the bottom of the leaderboard. This means that the two didn't garner nearly as many votes as some who landed on the very bottom, including Joa Mobble and Jenna Johnson, 18 out of 30, John Schneider and Emma Slater. 21 out of 30, and Bobby Bones and Sharna Burgess 23 out of 30. Taking all that into account, Twitter seemed furious that both Dinashe and Ivana landed in the bottom, while Bobby and John, the two who were targeted most with angry tweets, advanced. Despite their relatively low scores, I can't believe grocery store Joe and Bobby stayed knowing that they can't dance and Dinashe, one of the best dancers, gets eliminated. A huge mistake letting her go, full moon wolf face howling wolf wolf face full moon, add howling wolf underscore 24, October 16th 2018 advertisement, continue. Reading below this season of, people want to keep people like the mediocre guys cough cough Joe, Bobby, and John asterisk cough. Cough asterisk Tina Shea and Ivana did not deserve bottom two picked at twitter.com slash beamjoven 6 c scary ghost at m underscore elizondo, October 16th 2018 I. Don't normally post opinions about the dancers during season, but I swear if Joe or Bobby stay one more week I'm sending several letters to the producers. Judges' scores should take over 75% of the elimination. Tina Shea deserved better. October 16, 2018 If the novices were good and actually improved every week then I wouldn't complain but Joe and Bobby continue to suck or make a fool out of themselves and they should have left before Tina Shea. 2018 Yikes! To be fair to Joe and Bobby, many found their performances from last week to be very entertaining. Even though they might not be the best dancers in the competition, they certainly know how to put on a good show. Advertisement, continue. Reading below advertisement, continue reading below Joe did so good tonight. I'm so glad. The fans are behind him, now if the judges would get with it. Can see him open up more every week. Week's results were revealed, Tina Shea and Brandon were filmed talking about how upset they were that they landed in the bottom last week despite receiving a high score. Ultimately, Nancy Mikian and Val Chemerkovsky were sent home, but Tina Shea and Brandon came second to last when audience votes were considered. At the time, Tina Shea said she had mixed feelings because we got our highest score so far. Brandon told her though that a lot of Times the best dancers are the ones that go home the soonest. Advertisement, continue. Reading below, unfortunately, it looks like Brandon was right. Yet another shining example of just how important it is to vote. Dancing with the Stars is on Monday nights at 8 p.m. Eastern Time on ABC.